Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you guys five easy and quick beginner tips in Darktable. Right, so the first tip is how to import your images. All you gotta do is click the symbol and then you can select the image that you want to import. Click it, hit open and then it will show up here. If you want to import a folder you can use the same way click it and then you can import the entire folder now let me cancel that one tip number two is how to export your photo so once you're done editing your photo all you gotta do is click this one export selected browse the location that you want the photo to be exported to make sure that the profile is set to srgb because that way it will make sure that the image that you're seeing on the screen will showcase the same colors online or on Instagram or wherever you're going to post it without it being changed or altered. And then hit export and the image will be exported to the designated folder. Tip number three is changing your settings. And you can do so by clicking the gear icon over here. And then it'll take you into the preferences menu. You can change the GY options the core options, session options, and even the shortcuts. So if you want to know where a shortcut stands for, or if you want to change the shortcut, you can do over here. So I'm going to close that one down and we're going to move on to tip number four, which is finding modules. For that, we need to be in the darkroom menu. Now, if you want to find a module, you can do so by clicking this over here. These are the groups. So we've got the basic group, we've got the tone group, We've got the color group, we've got the correction group, and we've got the effects group. And if that doesn't work, you can find the modules over here. So let's say I want to find the basic adjustments. There you go. I just type it in and it shows up here. Another way to do this is by going to more modules and then find the module in the list down below. Tip number five is adding them to your favorites menu. And for that, what you need to do as soon as you found a module, all you gotta do is press this little symbol right here and then click favorite. And then it'll show up in this group over here, which is your favorites group. And as you can see, here it is. Here's the basic adjustment 